welcome back to Kids Yoga. And um, today we're gonna have lots of fun. We're doing a story about the new year, along with teddy bears and other animals. So go ahead and get a yoga friend at home, any stuffed animal. Hi, I see you have yours. Yeah, go ahead and hold your yoga stuffed animal friend close to the screen. Hi. Hi. Good. So we're going to go ahead and start by talking about the books we're going to read. We're going to read one book, Happy New Year, Herbie Bear. And it's about a bear that celebrates Happy New Year with his family. And then we're going to read a really short book, Happy New Year Spot, about a yellow dog. And super excited to finally at the end do lots and lots of teddy bear yoga. And this book has lots and lots of yoga poses that you can do with your yoga friend at home. Let's go ahead and pick up your yoga friend. And let's start out with our breath. So point to your yoga friend's nose. Good. Point to your nose. Point to your yoga friend's mouth. Good. Point to your mouth. Very easy. Good. So in yoga, when we need to find some calmness, we inhale through our nose, exhale out our mouth. So go ahead and point to your yoga friend's nose and bring your yoga friend's nose really close to the screen so I can see. Good. Now as you point to your yoga friend's nose, you inhale through your nose. Then point to the mouth and you exhale and let's go really far back. Good. Okay, point to the nose and then bring your yoga friend close. Are you inhaling through your nose? Good. <laughs> point to the mouth and let's exhale out our mouth and go back. Good. One more. Inhale. Show me that cute nose of your yoga friend. Hello. Point to the mouth and exhale. Good. Okay. So that is one way to do our calm breath. Let's next take your hands and bring them up to the screen so I can see. Wiggle your fingers. Good. We're going to do the five finger breath. So before we do that, we want to talk about New Year's. And New Year's, they watch the ball drop. And they watch this ball drop in New York City. And they count down from 10 to 1. And when it gets 1 and the ball drops, they all jump and shout, Happy New Year! So we're going to go ahead and do our five finger breath. Next, we're going to do 10, drop down, jump up, and say Happy New Year. So let's start with five first, okay? Okay, show me your hand. Good. Here we go. Inhale and exhale. Follow along. Good. Inhale. Nice. Exhale. Inhale, exhale. Are you breathing? Good. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Ah. Take your hands in prayer. Do you feel peaceful? Good. Now, let's do 10. And after 10, we're going to drop down and jump up and say Happy New Year. So we're gonna do 10 fingers, ready? Let's start with one hand, here we go. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Good, inhale, take big breaths, exhale. Inhale, really big breath, exhale. Inhale, here we go, next hand, exhale. Next hand, inhale, just five more, we're almost there. Exhale. Inhale, 
Inhale, can you bring your hand closer to the screen? I see you, exhale. Inhale, exhale. That's relaxing, inhale. Good breath, exhale. Just one more, are you ready? Inhale, now as we exhale, let's go all the way down. Ready? And jump in the air, happy new year. Good, okay. Now let's go ahead and take our yoga friend and we're gonna do our whole body movement with our yoga friend. Go ahead and stand up, guys. Get your yoga friend out. Okay, take your yoga friend on your head. Can I see? Good, let's stand up, inhale, and as you exhale, we're gonna count to 10. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Can you go all the way down? Good, ready, and happy new year. Good, okay, let's try that again. Ready, yoga front on your head. We're gonna count from 10 backwards. Here we go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Happy new year. Good. Another way we can do our countdown is take our yoga friend really far back and then we're gonna go forward slowly all the way down. And then don't come all the way down until you hit number 10, until you go to one, counting backwards from 10. Ready? Let's stretch. Take your yoga friend up, lean back. You ready to start? Here we go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Happy New Year! <laughs> Good! Okay, we are all ready and excited for our Happy New Year story. Good. So Happy New Year with Herbie the Bear. Look how excited he is. Here we go. You have your yoga friend next to you. Hi, I see. We're gonna start out. Here's Herbie. It says, tonight's the night, said Herbie Bear. Tonight is the night? Hmm. Herbie was thinking. Herbie thought he's gonna stay up all night tonight, really, really late. Oh, but everyone's sleeping. Why do you think Herbie thinks he's gonna stay up really late tonight? Why? Well, his dad told him it was December 31st. It was New Year's Eve. Herbie's dad told him he could stay up. They would celebrate the new year together. Just like we did, jumping up, counting from 10 backwards. Well, his dad told Herbie, the new year begins at midnight. Dad said, that's pretty late. Dad looked at the clock. It might be hard to stay awake that long, he said. Do you think you could stay up that late? Well, Herbie said, I'm gonna stay up late and I'm going to drop a ball. Herbie thinks he's gonna drop a basketball. Is that the kind of ball we were talking about? Haha, <laughs> Dad laughed. We don't drop that kind of ball. We drop a special ball. 
It's a special ball that drops in the city of New York. They count to 10 backwards. And so they stayed up late. They played games, watch a movie, and then before it was midnight, guess who fell asleep? He tried. Oh, he tried. Well, it was midnight, and Herbie whispered, Happy New Year, and then went back to sleep. And Herbie just slept smiling. Okay, so let's go ahead and do some more Happy New Year stretches. So go ahead, pick up your yoga friend. Go ahead and stand in star pose. Take your yoga friend over your head. Good. And let's go ahead and stretch down. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Are you down here? I hope you are. I see you. Ready? Happy New Year. <laughs> Good. Let's try the other side. Get your yoga friend, guys. Here we go. Stand and start. Yoga friend over your head. Count down to New Year's. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Almost there. 4, 3, 2, 1. Are you here? Are you ready? Happy New Year. Good. Okay. We're going to do another stretch. This one we're going to go ahead and lay on the ground. Pick up your yoga friend with you. Here we go. Lay on the ground. Ah. Okay. Let's go ahead, come up, and we're going to start to roll back. Take your yoga friend over your head. Good. Ready, guys? Here we go. Come back slowly. Ten. resolution. And that is a wish for you to do something for yourself for next year. So this book is Happy New Year Spot. It's about a yellow dog who gets together with his friends 
Yeah. And what they do is they create a wish board. This says our wishes. Ah. So on this board, there are there's Spot <laughs> and a crocodile, a monkey, and a hippo. Oh, I see. And they all put a star on the board about their wishes for the new year. So let's go ahead and do that. Oh, and then in the morning, when the sun comes up, they all celebrate their wishes for the new year. So are you ready? Let's go ahead and start by being the crocodile. We're gonna go ahead and lay on the ground and grow into a yoga crocodile pose. So lay on your belly, hands down, lift your crocodile long neck. Here we go. Right here, feet are flat. Come down, lift your crocodile neck up. Good, now, can you go ahead and lift your belly? And then rock your, your hips side to side. Good. And go ahead and come down. Let's try that again. Lift your crocodile long neck. Lift your crocodile belly. Slide your hips side to side. Good. Okay. So, the crocodile made a wish and he put his wish or his star on the wish board. You see that? Next, there was a monkey and he did the same thing. So we're gonna go into monkey pose. So let's first take our legs bent, take your feet out and go side to side. Can you stretch the inner thigh there? Good, now take long monkey arms Bend one knee and reach towards the other foot. Whoa, good. And then monkey arms, bend the other knee, reach for the other foot. Ooh, that's a good stretch. Nice, let's add some monkey arms in between. Bend the knee, reach for the other foot. Good monkey arms, ooh, good stretch. I like that, okay monkey. Here you are, good. And reach, bend the knee, reach for the other side. Ooh, good monkey stretch. Good. Okay, next, on the wish board, we have a hippo. A hippo, well, in yoga, there is not a hippo pose I know about. What do you think would be a good hippo pose? What could we do for a hippo? Well, a hippo has big eyes, a big belly. <laughs> so we're gonna go into a pose called camel, but it looks like a hippo cause a big belly. So let's go on our knees. Curl our toes. So we're gonna pretend that this is hippo pose. Big belly, hands back on your hips, push your belly forward, open your eyes big. Good, now can you reach back one hand for your foot? Can you reach your other hand to your foot? Good, now let's make our hippo dance. Reach one arm up, and then reach the other arm up. come forward and relax and stretch. Ah. Let's try that again. Okay, hippo with a big belly. Curl your toes, hands on your hips. Push your hips forward, big hippo belly. Open your eyes big. Maybe one hand comes back. You can reach the other hand if you like. You have a big hippo belly. Can you make your hippo dance? Reach each arm up. Ooh, 
Ooh, that's a good stretch. Good. Are you pushing your hip bow belly out? Good. And let's go forward. And stretch forward and relax. Ah. Good hip bows, guys. Okay, the next animal we see in our book is Spot, the yellow dog. Aww, it's cute. And he's going to put his star on the Our Wishes board. So let's go in down dog. Here we go. I like this pose. So palms out or your or paws out. <laughs> yeah, you got it. Thank your doggy legs. Good. Wiggle your doggy tail. Good. Okay, we're gonna do all four animals together. We're gonna start in our crocodile pose, then go to our monkey, then our hippo, and then our dog pose. Do you remember all of them? Okay, ready? Crocodile pose. Here we go. Lift up. Good. Lift your hips. Good. Let's come down. Try that again. Lift your crocodile neck. Lift your hips and sway. Good crocodiles. Next, our monkey. Bend your knees. Yes, you got it. Take one leg bent, one leg stretch. Monkey arms. Reach for that foot. Monkey arms stretch. Long monkey arms. Good. Monkey. And just bend the other knee. You got it. And stretch towards that straight leg. Ooh. Let's do that. One more time, monkey, push your arms. That's cute. <laughs> you are silly monkeys. Bend that knee, straighten that leg, stretch, reach. Ah. That feels good. Let's do the other side. One more time. Hello, monkeys. Here we go. Bend that knee, straighten that leg, reach. Long monkey arms. Okay. Now it's our hippo. So we need to get a big belly. Come down to our knees. You remember, curl your toes, hands on your hips, big hippo belly. Reach back for your feet if you like. Make your hippo dance. Good. Open your eyes big. Push your belly out. <laughs> Be careful. Stretch. Ah, oh, good job. Okay, you want to try that again? You can if you want. I'll join you. Ready? Curl your toes, bend your knees, hands on your hips. Push your hips forward. Big hippo belly. Good. Stay here if you like or reach an arm back. Try the other arm, but you don't have to. And then hippo can dance. Nice. I love that belly pushing out. I see that belly. Good. And hippo comes forward. from this book. Next, we're going to go ahead and move on. But before we do, after they all put their star on the wish board, they all said Happy New Year! So let's go ahead and pretend that we are putting a star on the wish board. And this can be a wish board in your mind or in your heart. You don't have to actually have a board. But let's go ahead 
and take your hands and make a star. Take your hands together and put your hands like this. Make a star. Good. So this is your star. Good. Close your eyes. Keep your hands open like this, close to your heart. Close your eyes. Now make a wish on your wish board in your mind or in your heart. This is your wish for yourself, your New Year's resolution. Do you wish for peace? Do you wish for happiness? Are you thankful? Good. Let's go ahead and do a one more stretch and then do a Happy New Year jump. Ready? Pick up your yoga friend. Good. Let's go ahead and stand up. Arms come up, reach your yoga friend back. We're gonna count down from 10. Here we go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Happy New Year! Yay! How you doing? Good! Okay. Now go ahead and take your yoga friend and we're gonna count down with our yoga friend. Put your yoga friend at the top of the camera so I can see. And we're gonna go down slowly. And then after 10, we're gonna do a Happy New Year dance. Are you ready? Here we go. Start at the top of the screen. Good. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Happy New Year! <laughs> Good! Okay, so now that we have that done, let's move on to our last book today, Yoga with a Teddy Bear. A story of an extra extraordinary bear. Oh, I'm excited about this. Okay. Once upon a time, there was a bear and he lived in a very dark room. And he said, oh, it's so dreary and dark in here. But then, one day, light appeared in the window. And the bright light filled the room. Here is the bear, and look at all the things in the teddy bear's room. Then, a big gust of wind came in through the window and blew right up the teddy bear's nose. The teddy bear took a deep breath for the first time. Breathe in deeply, breathe out completely. Do you do that? Inhale and exhale. Then in the room, one of the toys was a cat. The cat awoke from her nap and stretched. And the teddy bear stretched too. Let's do that. Some cat stretches. Good. Good, I see you. Then, a dog came in the room. The dog has sunglasses. And the teddy bear said, I can do that too. Outside a window, a big mountain was there. Come out and play, teddy bear. The teddy bear said, I can stretch my arms up over my head, thought the teddy bear. I'll make myself big like a mountain. It feels good to stretch. Good. Next, the teddy bear 
climbed out the window while the mountain watched closely. There's the mountain looking. Why, you are no ordinary teddy bear, boomed the mountain. You're a yoga teddy bear. And the bear said, I am yoga teddy bear. The teddy bear realized with delight. Are you ready? Let's go ahead, do some cat cow stretches, down dog stretch, mountain stretch, and tree pose. Here we go. Come down here. Here's our cat cow. Ooh, good stretching. We could be a yoga teddy bear too. Good. And down dog. Kick your legs. Good. Let's go ahead, come forward, lift up, mountain pose, reach far back. Good. And then take your hands in prayer and come in tree pose, one leg up. Good. And switch legs. Let's try that again. Are you ready? Let's be like the teddy bear. This is fun. Let's come back to our cat cow. Here we go. Hands come down. Hands and knees, cat cow. Good. Let's do our down dog. Kick our legs. Stretch those legs. Reach the arms long. Good. Now we're going to come up into our mountain pose. Stand up, reach your arms back. Good stretch. And then hands in prayer. Tree pose. Ah, nice. Tree pose, other side. Good. Okay, so that is what Teddy Bear did. Let's see what he did next. From that moment on, the world opened up to the teddy bears. He went outside and he saw the whole world was filled with yoga. There's a plane, there's mountain, there's trees. So he went into an airplane pose. Then, after looking up, he looked down low and he saw that he could be like the cricket and went into cricket pose. And then he had a picnic and saw a sandwich stretching. So he said, I can be a sandwich too. Ha <laughs> ha. Then he went to the jungle and saw a lion. He said, I can be a lion too. Then he went to the desert and saw a snake and said, I can be a snake too. Are you ready? Let's go ahead and start with our airplane pose flying. Are you ready? Here we go. So let's be like the teddy bear, look up and we see an airplane. Good. Can you switch the other leg? Now, let's look down below and we see a cricket. Let's come down and then be a cricket. Reach your arms and legs up. Good. Kick your cricket legs. And now let's have a picnic, teddy bear. And let's be a sandwich. Legs forward, reach your arms up and be a sandwich. <laughs> Good. And then he saw a lion. So lion pose. Let me show you what lion pose is. Here is lion pose. So you go on your knees, your hands forward, and you stick your tongue out. <laughs> that is good. You guys are really good at sticking your tongues out. Let's try that. So lion pose. You guys are fun. Right here, bend your knees, hands down. Stick your tongue out. <laughs> and then snake pose. So go forward, lift up our head. Good. Okay, let's see what else does a teddy bear find? 
find. And then the teddy bear said, you can also do yoga inside. You don't have to be outside to do yoga, but you can look outside and see a pigeon. So he's doing pigeon pose. You wanna try pigeon pose with me? You bend a leg, reach one leg back, good, good. And then he went outside and saw a slide or a bridge and he said, I can be bridge pose too. Good. So let's try pigeon and bridge. You got it. These are great poses. You're doing great. So pigeon pose, you go ahead and take one leg in and one leg back. Then this leg forward and stretch. Ooh. Let's lift up pigeons and come down. And lift up pigeons. Oh, do you feel that stretch? And come down. Good. And then let's try the other side. Try the pigeon. You need to stretch the other leg, right? So you can take one leg side, bring it over. Ready? Let's go down, pigeons. And come up. Ah, oh, good stretch. Good, let's do that one more time. Come down. And up, good stretch. Then they did the boat pose. Oh no, the bridge pose. So the next one, after the pigeon, was the bridge pose. Yeah! Good! Push your hips really high. And you see how the teddy bear is reaching his hands towards his feet? Can you walk your feet towards you? You can even go on tippy toes. Can you reach for your feet like that? Wow, good. You gotta push your belly out really big. Nice. Next. Oh, this is a good pose. He went to the ocean and found a dolphin. So in yoga, dolphin poses like this. It is like down dog, but you bend your arms. So you see how, yeah, you got it. Nice. So in down dog, our hands are normally like this. But in dolphin, we take our arms bent like this. You can even take your hands together into a fist if you like. You want to try that? Here we go. So you go into your down dog, then you bend your elbows. You can even take your hands in a fist. And then lift up, be on your tippy toes. That's a dolphin. Oh, I like that, good. Okay, let's see what else the teddy bear found. So, then the teddy bear, this is fun also found things that are small. This is a baby frog. Oh, how cute. So you see what the bear is doing? His knees are bent outside. His legs are wide. His feet are turned out. And he's on his elbows. This one is hard. You guys are really trying the best you can. I know you are. <laughs> uh, this one's hard for me, but we're gonna do our best, okay? So, you take your legs out, bend your knees. Yeah! Good. Let's try that. I don't know if I can do that. Here we go. So, we're here. We are bending our knees. Take our legs wide. And come to our elbows. And this is your frog. <laughs> How are you doing? You know what? I have an idea. Let's take my yoga friend here and see if we can put my yoga friend in the frog pose. So, we're gonna go ahead and move my yoga friend's arms. Then, take his legs back. Take his other leg back. Oh, are you trying with your yoga friend at home too? 
Okay, so this is frog pose. Legs are bent behind. <laughs> Good. Now let's see if my teddy bear can do dolphin pose. Do you remember? What was dolphin pose? What was dolphin pose? This one. Can you do that with your yoga friend at home? Let's see if I can do that with my yoga friend. Good, I see yours. So it's like down dog, yeah. I see you, good. It's move the arms and legs. So it's like a down dog, uh-huh. And then you bend the arms and it's like this. I can't really do it with this one. <laughs> We're trying. Good, you got it, I see it. Good. Okay, now let's see what else the teddy bear discovers. So the teddy bear goes out and looks way up and discovers the moon. This is half moon pose. Can you try that? Half moon pose and balance. Yeah, good, you got it. Nice. Let's try that. Ready? Standing up. Go to one side. Pick up. Whoa! That is half moon pose. Try the other side. How are you doing? That is hard. Do the best you can. Good. Okay. So let's go ahead and do our half moon pose and count to 10 and then jump up. Ready? Let's go ahead, come up. Go into our half moon pose. Are you ready to count down for the new year? We're gonna go down slowly to the ground. Ready? 10, nine, eight, Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Happy New Year! Good! Let's try the half moon pose on the other side. Are you ready? Okay, here we go. Half moon pose, balance. Whoa, it's okay if you fall over. Just be careful. Let's count down to 10. Counting backwards slowly, here we go. Are you ready? 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Happy New Year! <laughs> good, that was really good, okay. Next one, the teddy bear looked up at the clouds and saw the lion and the dog and him relaxing on a cloud. Aww. So let's go ahead and lay down on a cloud with our yoga friend. And then we're gonna come down slowly to 10. Here we go. Up. Yoga friend here. Here we go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ah. Okay. I'm relaxed. I hope you're relaxed. Let's go ahead and come up. Now that we did all of those poses, I want to show you all of the poses that you can do at home if you want to practice. So let's start out and see what poses we did. We did the cat pose, the cow pose. Good. We did the downward facing dog. We did the mountain pose, the tree pose. 
We did the airplane pose. We did the grasshopper and the sandwich. There's our half moon pose. There's our resting pose. Good. Now let's see if there's a couple poses that we have not done yet. We did not do, oh, we did all of the only pose we did not do is hero pose. So this pose here is hero pose. You bend your knees and your hands are on your thighs. And this one, you really gotta make sure that your knees are together. Good, good. So our knees are together and this is hero pose. Now, another way to do hero pose is to keep your legs bent like this and then take your legs to the side. So that you're sitting down your bottom, good, and your feet are to your side. Now, if this is uncomfortable, then you can always come down and rest in child pose. Okay? Or if you want, follow along. So we take our legs to the side, and then, are you ready? This is a big hero pose stretch. Only if you feel comfortable, we go back. Whoa! How are you doing? Did you do it? Good! Can you reach your arms over your head? You feel that stretch? Are you stuck? Go ahead and come up. And let's come in child pose. So take your legs together. Come forward and stretch and rest. today. Which was your favorite? I like the hero pose. That was new today. I hope you guys have a happy new year. We're going to go ahead and end by taking our hands in prayer. And then we're going to do our star thought. So take your hands out wide. Good. And put your hands at your heart. Think about putting a wish on the board or a wish in your heart or mind close your eyes make a wish for the new year wish for hope and peace good and then take your hands in prayer and let's do our peace breath together inhale rise the hands up Exhale, lower to your heart. One more. Inhale, rising up. Exhale, lower. And we always say namaste. Namaste. And we know namaste means the spirit in me honors the spirit in you. Good. So for the new year, have a good wish in your heart, in your mind. Thank you.